Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video showing you guys some swatches of my collection of the Sephora Lip Stories lipsticks. I really wanted to do this video because I love these lipsticks. Like, they are amazing and nothing less and i literally just want to tell everyone about them because they're only like eight bucks or something they're super cheap especially being at sephora the formula is amazing i would definitely say these are more of like a cream sheen finish but i honestly love that formula for lipsticks more than like a matte lipstick i'm not sure how many lipsticks this collection has but i personally have five of them so i'm going to be showing you guys some swatches side by side Now I wanted to show you guys what they looked like on my lips. We're going to start with the lightest color and the color is Tan Lines. So this is a super light pale nude. I honestly never planned on wearing this lipstick alone. I thought it would pair great with a brown lip liner or just over top of like a dark brown lipstick. So in this swatch, I'm actually going to add some lip liner just to give it a little bit more dimension and show you guys what I'm talking about. The next color is Yum Yum. This is my favorite lipstick in this collection that I own. So in the swatch, you do see that it is a medium brown but if you want to make it lighter you can always just dab it on and not do a full swipe and that's what I usually do because I like the look of like a lighter brown that has that really beautiful cream sheen finish. Of course I had to get some colors in here and I honestly really wanted to get like the orange one but reds will do. So this one is in the color Labyrinth City. It's just kind of like a berry color and what I love about this lipstick is that yes it is a color and it's bold but it's also kind of muted and it can really pass for like an everyday color. Next I have a deeper red. This is called After Hours and Honestly guys, this might be the most perfect red that I have bumped into in my lipstick years. I love this color on my skin tone so much because like I said about the last color, it is a bold color, but something about it makes it like look like you can wear it on an everyday basis, which is amazing because you would never think about that for a red color. I don't know, I'm just obsessed with this shade. I don't know what about it, but I love it, love it, love it on my skin. The last lipstick I have is the darkest one I have. It's in the color Fireside, and honestly on camera, it might look even black, but it's just a really, really dark brown. I love wearing these kinds of lipsticks, especially when I'm doing super dramatic makeup. I think it pairs really well with like a brown, deep, smoky eye. But sometimes I even like to use this color as like a lip liner for maybe the Yum Yum color so I can have a little bit of a darker outline um, and then have the medium brown in the middle. Or if I'm feeling really bold, I'll just wear it by itself. So that's it of my lip stories collection. I know at Sephora, sometimes they're out of stock on a lot of the lipsticks just because they are so popular right now. So if you are my skin color, I hope this video helped to see it on me and hopefully you can just purchase it on Sephora.com. Comment down below if you guys have any of these lipsticks or are wanting to purchase some and let me know what your favorite color is. I know there are so many more in the collection that I wanna try, but again, they're like always out of stock. Honestly, since the Sephora is opening up, hopefully I can go there like the first couple of days and get my hands on some more lip stories because I definitely want to add some color to my collection. But I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye guys!